Hi right, everybody, what is going on? It is your boy C4 here, bringing you another Projected Madden 15 overall rankings video. You smashed the 15 likes on the previous video, so here it is for the Kansas City Chiefs. As always, once this video hits 15 likes, I will upload the next team. If you think a player should be upgraded or downgraded in my rankings, make sure you leave a comment in the comment section below. And without further ado, jumping into the quarterback position, we gave Alex Smith an 85 overall. Uh, still, you know, has a, still is a game manager of quarterback. Had just over 3,000 passing yards, 23 touchdowns, 7 interceptions. Doesn't make a lot of errant throws, but, you know, a lot of passes outside of the back. You know, when you have Jamal Charles back there, it's pretty hard to look like a terrible quarterback. Uh, does a lot of the work for you, but still, he did not turn the ball over a lot, and he led his team to the playoffs, so that's why we gave him an 85. But, uh, you know, you got Eric quarterback, rookie quarterback Aaron Murray waiting in the winks. Gave him a 70, or 69 overall. Uh because I think there's some some contract talks or something like that going on with Alex Smith at the moment. Uh, at the running back position, Jamal Charles gets a 99. Almost had 2,000 total yards from scrimmage and 19 touchdowns. Uh, you know, as good as any other player in the league, 99 is very just. The wide receiver position, we gave Dwayne Bowen 85. Uh, I think he's one of the more overrated players in the league. Last year at 57 receptions, 670 yards, and 5 touchdowns. Uh, you know, 85 is even a stretch. That wasn't very productive at all. Donnie Avery, we gave an 81. Uh, Donnie Avery had uh, 40 receptions, 596 yards, and two touchdowns. But uh, obviously, you know, I was surprised the Chiefs didn't address wide receiver position during the draft. But it is what it is. You know, not terrible ratings. Tight end position, we gave Anthony Fasano an 82 overall. Um, you know, did they just bring him in? No, they had him last year. He played nine games, had 200 yards and three interceptions, or 200 yards and three touchdowns. But you know, he's a good blocker, good all-around uh, tight end there. Left tackle, they got the Canadian Laurent Duvernay Tardif. You might start have a chance. A uh, great tackle from Canada. Look out for him in training camp. They got Jeff Allen, 79 overall left guard. Uh, Rodney Hudson, 81 overall center. Jeff Lincolnbach, 72 over right guard. And Eric Fisher. 81 overall right tackle, their first round pick from uh, a year ago. Had a solid rookie campaign, but definitely they might want to strip that offensive line to give Jamal Charles as much success to replicate his stats last year. And now left end, we gave Allen Bailey a 73 overall. Obviously, you're, he's probably the weakest guy on their entire defensive line. Uh, you know, doesn't play a whole lot, but he gets his chance to start because when at right end, you got Mike DeVito. I uh, believe, did he even play last year? He had 20 sacks, or 20 sacks, 20 tackles last year. Uh, but he's still, like, he's one of those guys that doesn't really show up on the stat, stat sheet. You know, he gets uh, gets done, down and dirty kind of player. Uh, but you obviously got the rookie D Ford, 74 overall. He probably will be starting for, or pressing for the starting position. They might have DeVito on one side and D Ford on the other. But defensive tackle, you got Don Terry Poe, probably one of the best 3 4 defensive tackles in the league. Gave him a 91 overall. Four and a half sacks, 50 tackles last year. Uh, left outside linebacker Justin Houston, 94 overall. Uh, had 11 sacks last year, 44 tackles. He's an absolute animal. Middle linebacker Derek Johnson, 91 overall. Uh, had just over 100 tackles last year. Four and a half sacks, two interceptions. You know, uh, ageless wonder almost. And outside linebacker Tom Bahali, 94 overall. Had 11 sacks as well. Uh, just over 45 tackles. One interception, too. Can't, can't forget that. But, I mean, they have a lot of pass rushing here at the linebacking core. Uh, for the cornerback position, Brandon Flowers, we gave him a 92. One of the best shutdown corners in the league. Only had one interception, but had 70 tackles. Uh, you know, a lot of people try to avoid him. Uh, Sean Smith came in from uh, the think, think Miami Dolphins. Uh, had two interceptions. He's a big body t uh, corner. Six foot three, 214 pounds. Uh, you know, 85 overall, very just. Hussein Abdullah, 79 overall. Uh, I think he only had like 30 tackles. Obviously, it's his chance to really start to shine. But Eric Berry, 90 overall, strong safety. Eric Berry is excellent. Uh, maybe could this this is one of those rings that could be actually a little bit higher. Uh, finished last year with three and a half sacks, three interceptions, and 80 tackles. So I mean, he's still one of the premier safeties in the league. Uh, uh, kicker Ryan Suck of 81. And punter Dustin Colquitt, 85. But there you have it, guys. Those are your Kansas City Chiefs projected Madden 15 overall rankings. As always, once this video smashes a 15 like mark, I will upload the next video. Uh, if you disagree, you think a player should be upgraded or downgraded, make sure you leave a comment in the comment section below. Make sure you subscribe to Beast Mode TV. And until next time, guys, it is your boy C4 saying peace out.